YouTube, what's the righteous word? It's your boy Gangland Neem, aka Neeman, I before the E. Golly, I don't know y'all. Remember that. And we back with another video. So I came across this clip. Your boy Sharp sitting with the cocaine by. Now I just want to say this about Lush, man. Like, if this is your first time to the channel, please like, subscribe, comment, share, please, and thank you. I need that for the algorithm. If you go to the top of the page, hit that Instagram link, follow me on Instagram. Um, this is what I want to say about Lush, though. Lush is super weak, man. And I don't mean that to be foul or nothing, but it's like, dude, you keep surrounding yourself with people who don't care about you, who don't have your well-being in they forefront, you know what I'm saying? You just running around here on everybody platform, doing it up, whatever. But anyway, we're going to get into these couple clips. And it's basically talking about how, like, y'all remember the whole cocaine bot era or whatever? You feel me? That was some, some stuff that was going on at No Jumper. This fool did a freestyle, called itself the cocaine bot. They start making merch. Merch sold out. This nigga ain't getting nothing from it. But anyway, let's start this. And we go back and we can walk through all that. Cocaine Bot was something sensational. Hey, hey. He was supposed to run with that gang. Hey. I don't know what yeah, you God. did that you didn't do right with that, but like, I like how, like, even Brick, right? That's why I support the Kill, Kill Squad. Squad. Yeah. That's why I support it. Because he turned that sh into something dope. Like, right. you were, you had people f with that, bro. Right. Like, and it's like you didn't do shit with it. no well, merch. I no. So they made the no no jumper made cocaine bot merch, and like like at that time like I literally I'm, this is very new to me. Yeah yeah yeah. Remo designed it and everything. You feel me? And they were they were selling it. There's cocaine bot tees, which by the way I never got. I was bro, how are they selling merch with your face on it that you don't have? At this point, it's like yo, who fault is that? You know what I'm saying? This is what I mean about Lush. Like, that's crazy, bro. You just get used and whooped out. Now you over here at Sharp Platform, like Sharp could do something for you. You don't even realize what you're doing for Sharp being on his stream right now. You don't have a cocaine bot t-shirt, bro. Golly. How the cocaine bot don't own a cocaine bot t-shirt? I'm tripping. Still love if they, if somewhere in the cut. They, they were selling our eye too. They was the, you feel me? They was moving units Ooh. and uh at the end of the day, like regardless, like I, I heard nothing of this. It, it was a hey, uh, see if anyone in the chat remembers a cocaine bot tees. Does anybody in the chat have a cocaine bot t shirt? They snatched that shit off the website, drop the cocaine bot emojis in the chat if you remember. Been, that should have been moving. Yeah, it's not too late. It's not sharp, don't have nothing to say. Sharp, don't know what. <laughs> What he talking about? It's just crazy, but it's like hit this. This is pimping. This pimping right here. It's funny how he just spin y'all a bunch of spinach. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I watch his stuff and he just spin you. He say all kind of random ass stuff that could like pertain or not. It's just like not too late. You yeah, me? brother. The bot lives on. The sun shines when it's in the air. Are. Like what are you it's talking? About? Yeah, like. Also, at the time, like, I really didn't, I was just, like, really didn't, I was just, like, I had put all my eggs in that basket. Like, no jumper consumed my existence. I didn't really have shit going on for myself other than oh, that at that really? time. You feel me? Like, now I'm in a much better place in life. You know, I'm reconnected with my family. Got my Can lady. I say I'm upset that I didn't get a cocaine ball t-shirt? If anyone remembers. Can I say that? that? At this point, he trolling. I'm not even gonna lie to you. At this point, Sharp is trolling. Like, come on, dog. Like, for myself. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I'm upset that I didn't even get to get one. Like, what the f***? Like, that shit was popular. It, I mean, it's still living now. I mean, it's... Yeah. I feel like you should have did way more with it than what you did. We might need to re-rock that. You gotta re-rock the song, the cocaine bot. <laughs> you feel me? Like you gotta yeah. really drop it. Crack bro. bot. <laughs> no, not the crack bot. Come on, bro. No, I can't stand behind that. I, 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 the only reason I'm standing behind the cocaine bot is because I know it did good for you, bro. But it like, did. 
I, I don't want that to f with your mind either to make you go and actually do cocaine. Nah. You know, I ain't gonna lie. And we go. But that's the clip right there. You know what I'm saying? Uh, again, it's just, I just feel like shame on Lush. You know what I mean? I expect this out of Sharp. You feel me? You have no f real fruitful conversation for for Lush. It's not like you talk hip hop. I, I've never heard Sharp talk hip hop. And, and he's part of one of the most successful hip hop platforms in Los Angeles in the last decade. But I've never heard him talk hip hop. And he was part of a, a group. Point and shoot told me. Point and shoot told me they was part of a rap group called the Crane Crushers. Crane Crushing Rob. You know what I'm saying? Or, or something like that. So it's like, and you never talk hip hop. You get me? So what you got him on here for? Just to just to make another viral moment. And it's crazy because Lush don't understand that. They invited him back on Fig. Where everybody came through. That was one of the most lit streams ever. If y'all did not catch that, shout out to Back on Fig. They had a stream. It was like all the ex-employees. It really wasn't no super bashing what you would have thought. You know what I'm saying? They all got their issue off, but it was just a dope stream. It looked like it was fun. You feel me? They invited bro over there, but instead he wanted to go to No Jumper. You know what I'm saying I did a video on that where he went over there to No Jumper and they and they was trying to make him black out. He didn't black out. He ended up throwing up, coming right back down to sit down with vomit breath. You feel me? But that was their goal to get him there, get him super throat black, literally for him to black out. You know what I'm saying? And this is what he do. He still maneuver and deal with these kind of people. That's kind of crazy to me. You know what I'm saying? It's like. Sometimes you be a glutton for punishment. You know what I mean? You want to go like, I, I tapped in with bro not too long. Well, it was a cold minute ago, but it was when all this was going on. And I was like, hey, bro, I wanted to have him on the platform because y'all know how I speak about like drug abuse and addiction and all that. You feel me? Um, I thought his story was dope. And I know some people who like, like we got mutual homies. So I was just like. Let me reach out to bro and see if I could get that conversation cracking because I thought it would be dope. Not hating on bro for not responding because, hey, bro, you don't got to respond or nothing. But it's like, I just say that to say, yo, a nigga want to reach out just on some like, yo, get your story type deal. You know, say your life story about how you got through addiction, whatever. You're back on the wagon now. You know what I'm saying? Or off the way, however that go. I don't know. But um, he relapsed, basically. You know what I'm saying? It's like. Here you are dealing with people who like in your worst of times, they was beating on you. You feel me? It's, it's kind of crazy to me, but I guess that's how it go for the clout. That's why I be telling y'all, I don't do nothing for the clout, man. That's that's just wild to me. But um, prayers to Lush, you feel me? Because he looking kind of skinny and moving kind of murkish. But uh, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Again, if this is your first time to the channel, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. It's your boy Gangland Neem. Peace.